you guys, I've made a huge mistake. Last week I made a video called Minecraft Speedrunner Dream Busted for Cheating and then in parentheses drama. In that video I called out Dream for using hacks in Minecraft and said that I am no longer a fan. If you haven't seen the video go watch that one first and subscribe to my channel on Twitch. Then yesterday Dream responded to the allegations of cheating with his own video and after watching through this Dream I just want to apologize, man. Even though I was such a huge fan of you since the start, somehow I just got sucked into the hype and the drama and I got on the Dream cheated bandwagon. The allegations against Dream were so organized and well presented and there was a huge in-depth document detailing exactly how he cheated and everybody I knew was saying he cheated. Even though in my heart I knew Dream would never cheat in Minecraft, my brain was telling me, you know, why would a whole team of moderators go through these lengths to invalidate a speedrun? And it wasn't just me who fell for their trap. All of you out there thought he cheated, don't lie. And that's the only reason why I made my video was because you guys said he cheated, so really it's your fault. Well, turns out Dream brought in his own math expert. Bill Nye, the science guy. Yes, you heard me right. Now, I've never heard of this man, Bill Guy, science guy. To me, it would seem like he would be more of a science expert than math, but apparently he comes highly recommended. He's a professor at Harvard with a PhD in astronauts, and he is an expert in statistics and astro statistics, which is like spaceship formulas. He's practically proven to be the smartest human, so if you disagree with any of this, you are scientifically wrong. Bill Rye provided a counter document critiquing the document provided by the Minecraft mods who don't even have a PhD in subtraction. I mean, let's be honest here, these Minecraft moderators are just jealous of his subscribers. They probably don't know a whole lot about math. They were extremely biased and cherry picking all their examples. Um, you know, they come across as just some kids that spent a little too much time on Reddit, if you ask me. Uh, give me one second, you guys. I'm just double checking this math here. Yep, yeah, there's no yeah, there's no way in the world he cheated. The moderators, uh, these these jokers said the odds of Dream Speedrun being legitimate were only one in seven point five trillion. Well, turns out that number was off by a lot. The guy that Dream hired said that the real odds of the speedrun being legitimate were actually one in a hundred million. Which come on now, one in a hundred million? That's you know, that's like a one in three shot at that point. We also have to remember that Dream would never lie to his fans. In all my years I've known Dream, he has never once lied, unlike these moderators who are extremely biased and performing all of these evil deeds every day. I think Dream's video made a lot of great points and it really disproved all the haters out there. And again, I just want to apologize to Dream for jumping the gun on this thing. It's really not like the internet to hop on a moronic bandwagon with absolutely no credible information to back their claims. If you like my apology video, be sure to visit my Twitch stream where I'll be discussing the latest controversy of the Wiggles lip syncing their songs. I really can't believe these fucking Wiggles would try to pull this bullshit on us. <laughs> <laughs>